the December Art Snacks box. And if you're not familiar with Art Snacks, it is a monthly subscription that sends you a sample of different um, art supplies. You can pay for it monthly, which is a little bit more expensive. It's $24 a month. Or you can do six months for $132 or 12 months for $240. And this is the U.S. subscription price. So let's open up December and see what we've got. All right. So in each box, you get a card that tells you about the items in the box. So each month you get a sticker with their logo. Usually it looks like this, but for special occasions, holidays, like winter, this has um, this balloon. I'm bummed out you can't really see it. It's got, um, it's a baby blue pretzel and it's got little teeny tiny white snowflakes on it. So here's what we got in our box. Oh, here's our art snack. So peppermint for December. A little quick look in our box and then we will open it up and break it down. So first thing we got is mixed media sample paper which is really cool. So I got a little skinny paper pad. What's in the front here? Ooh, coupon. Alright, so let's read. Where's our paper? So this is a bonus item, so the Grumbacher Mixed Media Paper Sample Pad. This month we've included a sample pad for you to try out your new supplies. The medium tooth texture of this heavy 185 GSM white drawing paper is excellent for dry media and light washes of wet media. Your colored pencils and markers will stand out beautifully on this paper. And I love the colored pretzels on there, that's really cool. All right, what else we got? Ooh, they sent us a pack of colored pencils. That's cool. I don't think I've ever gotten a little pack of colored pencils before. Oh no, the bottom broke. Oh well, that's okay. All right, let's read. And I know I'm gonna butcher this. The Bruinzeel Expression Colored Pencil Set. It is an Art Snacks exclusive, it is a limited edition, and it's new to Art Snacks. We specially designed this pack of Brunzeal Expression Color Pencils just for Art Snacks. Imported, imported, oh my goodness, imported from Holland, these cedar encased pencils are packed with quality pigments. Barely any pressure is needed to achieve bright color thanks to this pencil's strong, thick, 3.3 millimeter core. The vivid hues will pop off your page. I don't know how vivid they're going to be since they gave me browns, but that's okay. So we'll try those out in a second. All right, let's see what we got in our tissue. Where is it? There we go. Oh wow, oh, I love these crink pens. Awesome, all right, so we got a crink pen. Looks like a gel pen, maybe, and a marker. So let's get out some paper. Actually, we may just use this paper and test out our goodies. All right, I'm gonna fold this around, maybe. No, we'll just leave it like that because I'm afraid it's going to break off. All right, so first things first, let's um, let's test the color pencils. So let's take out what I got. Let's try not to take out the cardboard too, but okay. So here are our color pencils from Holland. Okay, I was smelling them. It says there's cedar. I was going to see if I could detect a cedar smell, but not really. Okay, so here are our colors. Does it say what they are? Nope, 
Not really. So we just got a number. Doesn't give the color name. So basically we got white, gray, black, and brown for our colors. So let's test them out. On our mixed media paper. So let's go in with the brown first. Really pretty. Okay, let's do gray next. I'm really liking these. Go, they go on really smooth. The pigment's really good. It's kind of hard to tell with the camera. But let's see if we can tilt it up a little bit. So I really like the pigment. It's really almost, I don't know if it's the light reflecting on it, almost metallic. Let's do black. Looks good. I mean, oh no, it got broke. So white is white. Let's go over it. Like a little bit. So white does really well too. I'm just kind of coloring over stuff because it's really not going to show up much. It's working good to kind of blend out my gray though. So I'm really liking these. All right, there we go. So the only thing, next time, I think we need to make this a little thicker because when you push it down, I mean, this is not holding it in. So I've got a big hole here and it came like that. So I think we, our packaging needs to be a smidge bigger or a little bit longer because this is causing the bottom to break open but other than that I really like the colored pencils all right next we've got the metallic Karen Dache I'm sure I'm butchering that Swiss made gold fibrillo marker if this is a staff favorite, everything you touch will turn to gold. Opaque metallic ink flows beautifully from this marker's fiber tip and is vibrant on paper. Don't worry about leaving the cap off. This marker can go seven days uncapped without drying out. I'm not going to test that out, so I'll take their word for it. Add some flair to your work by layering the ink over colored pencil. So it's a good thing. I tried the colored pencil first. So there is one end. Does it have two? Nope. So just got one in. All right. Let's look at the. Ooh. So that is stout. To me, I don't know. It's pretty gold, but it's got sort of a green kind of tinge to it. Um, still really pretty, really shiny. Let's see how it does going on top because it says I can color it on top of the colored pencils. So handles really well on top of the colored pencils. Let's kind of tilt it. So very pretty, very shiny. So there is our gold marker. I'm going to save the crink for last, I think. Next we've got a Pentel Sleecy, maybe? I'm not sure how you say that. But it is a gel pen. Get down to the details. This pen features an extra fine 0.25 millimeter metal tip, perfect for drawing on a smaller scale. Its ultra smooth gel ink is fast drying and comes in a variety of brilliant colors. Made from 87% recycled plastic, the pen is part of the Pentel Recyclology product line. So I guess they're make, trying to make a bunch of products out of recycled materials. So let's scooch our paper up a little bit. This is, whoa, this is a really, 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 really fine gel pen. So those of you that like inking, like gel pens, like drawing super detailed, this is a good pen for you because that that is really skinny really really skinny 
All right, and I saved the best for last because I have gotten one of these or something similar to this before, and I love these crink pens. So let's read a little bit about it. So the Crink K32 acrylic paint marker. In this month's box, we've included the K32 acrylic paint marker, a chisel tipped marker. Whoa, look at that. Filled with water based permanent acrylic ink. Not yet because it's still white. We got to do that. This ultra smooth opaque paint maintains its vibrant color on light or dark surfaces. To use, shake well until thoroughly mixed. Remove the cap. Press the nib down several times until saturated. All right. So take one last look of what it looks like all nice and clean before we fill it with some purple ink. All right. I think I've got it shaken up really good. It says. Remove the cap, press the nib down several times until saturated. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, here it comes. You can see it. I think it's done in there. Oh, look at that, people. Let's scooch up a little bit. Look at that. Still see it's still kind of a little wet. Oh, so pretty. I love, 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 love these pens. They are awesome. Look at that. Still kind of tell. Do you see the shiny? How it's still nice and wet. Oh, it's so pretty. And I can kind of tell it's starting to dry a little bit. Let's do a skinny line. Not too skinny. I think I may have gotten smidge too much ink in there but that's okay oh my goodness I love this yeah I've got a smidge too much ink in there but that's okay I love these things I'm so glad they sent me one of these and it's a pretty color all right so let's wrap up what we got so we got our mixed media paper and I hate to all right let's do this that way I'm not getting that crank ink on the inside so we got our mixed media paper our special color pencils from Holland our metallic marker our ultra fine gel pen, which is really, really cool, and our crank marker. And that is it for the month of December. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.